today would love to speak about getting the inspiration from the gorgeous landscape uh, uh, behind me. Where you see there is this line in the horizon between the sea and the sky, and it seems that the two of them uh, are kissing each other. But sometimes it's also the line, the subtle line that divides spirituality and material world that we experience, especially when we are starting a journey of our soul, uh, and we realize uh, how much is difficult uh, to have space and time to live a spiritual life. And this is because we think that they need to be separated, because we think that we need to make time in our daily life uh, to sit down, meditate, or practice some yoga, uh, ignoring that actually living a spiritual life is taking the journey of the soul uh, into our daily activities, is becoming spiritual when we are going to the supermarket, when we are uh, working our day, when we are in our jobs, in our businesses, because it's exactly this development of the soul um, is needed for us to merge um, the teachings and take them uh, in the physical world from a practical point of view. And it's always a matter of attitude because we can also sit down, uh, cross legs uh, every morning for 10 minutes uh, and meditate. And then the rest of our day is wasted uh, because we don't behave in a spiritual uh, way. Or when we are there sitting and meditating, our mind is somewhere else. Uh, we can we can basically save our time and avoid doing that because we are not actually doing that gesture in a spiritual way. While, for example, we take the spirituality in ourselves going to the supermarket and there is a long queue, over there we have the opportunity to practice patience. And that's uh, it's a spiritual activity that is uh, learning and teaching uh, our soul more than spending 10 minutes seated and uh, not being truly connected. Or uh, sometimes, especially when we are on a spiritual journey, we tend to isolate ourselves uh, and avoid some activities because we don't think that they are spiritual. So we, again, create this dualism and this separation, which is not what spirituality is about, is uh, finding the middle way, not isolating ourselves, not keeping ourselves far and in distance from the real world, but having a balance in wherever we are going, whoever we are meeting, and having an attitude, accepting that whatever challenge, whatever situation we are, it's something that we are learning for our souls that will be... Um, used in uh, in the karmic uh, um, situations of all the following reincarnations.